Hello everyone, and welcome into a bit of a different YouTube video. Um, I wanted to talk about YouTube and how I'm going to be moving forward with this channel. Because for those that have been here that have just started viewing the channel, um, you may have noticed that I was uploading daily up until yesterday. I missed yesterday's upload. Because up until yesterday, I had uploaded for 28 days straight. And during that time, I learned a lot about YouTube. I learned a lot about what I want to do with my content. I learned a lot about how I'm going to handle this channel moving forward. So when I started uploading daily, I didn't know how long I was going to do it for. I didn't know what I was doing in general. And I had no game plan. I just wanted to see how long I can keep it up for. I thought maybe it'd last like a week or two. I knew Thanksgiving was going to be a rough patch for me because I'd go home for an extended period of time. But I still made it happen. And in a sense, it kind of did well. I kind of, it, it happened. <laughs> so after 28 days of uploading, I present to you my numbers over here. Not over here. <laughs> These are the numbers um, for the YouTube channel in the past 28 days of uploading daily. A lot of those views are from three or four shorts that popped off. And I'm really appreciative of the advice that was given by my content creator friend, Willie Lowe. Um, the hours watched is interesting. And I appreciate that the subscriber count almost doubled on the channel because of my daily uploads. So I wanted to take a moment to explain what I was doing and how I'm going to change what I'm doing. So in the last 28 days, my only real goal was just to post once daily. No matter what the form of content it was, no matter how edited or unedited it was, no matter how I felt about what I was posting in terms of the length of the video, the content of the video, I wanted to put something out. And so I ultimately put out three different playthroughs during this time and a variety of shorts. And then also three entire game playthroughs of the Freddy Fresh franchise. And it was just kind of, we'll see how this goes. I'm gonna just post it and I'll throw it up on socials as well saying, hey, go chase this link and watch my videos. But this week, especially, I realized that's not exactly what I wanted to do. And I ultimately stopped posting on my socials about the YouTube channel, except for the Undertale series, because that actually did really well. I was shocked that I got double digit numbers off that video and very extended watch times off of that video as well. Um, so I sat down, I looked at that, I took the advice I was given, and I think I have decided on what my game plan is going to be moving forward. I have decided that we will continue to have daily uploads, but they're going to be a bit more structured. They're not going to be as random. There's going to be a schedule to things. There's going to be a rhythm. It's not going to be whenever I get to it, it gets posted. Um, so right now, the current playthrough is still Super Mario Wonder. Um, the Flashback Friday playthrough is still SpongeBob SquarePants. And the exclusive playthrough, which will probably be on the channel for a while, is Undertale. Um, those will have strict schedules of twice a week for Wonder, once a week for Flashback Friday, once a week for exclusive content. Shorts, however, I will still keep to once a day, Monday through Saturday, unless I am able to accrue a plethora of clips. That is my biggest weakness with shorts, is I have to find the clips on my own. It's hard to... um go back and try to remember moments during a stream where I was like, oh, I need a clip lot. I do have some offline tools now I have been utilizing, but the biggest thing also is I just don't have the time to edit clips like I've been seeing some of my friends do. I do want to start tinkering with that a little bit, but I know I cannot feasibly edit all of my shorts to be edited content. It's just not something on the table for me right now. However, I am going to start dedicating offline days towards YouTube content, whether it's gathering clips, making sure they're in good format to go up on YouTube, 
or recording the offline content like this or um the undertale franchise so there's going to be dedicated youtube editing days moving forward and also the last part there that i want to surprise everyone with is live streams are coming back to the channel i know i did once way back when for hi-fi rush i want to make that a monthly thing i want to once a month stream on youtube whether it's the simulcast with twitch and youtube or just a youtube live stream i want to make that happen speaking of youtube live streams this sunday december 10th i will be doing the first live stream for the monthly live streams as a simulcast on twitch i reached 300 followers over the last few months and i'm extremely grateful for that and that goal was to do a 12-hour variety stream of chat requested games we're going to simulcast that because it's going to be a bunch of games that youtube hasn't seen yet and that twitch either isn't the most familiar with or hasn't seen it either i've been collecting suggestions through discord i will continue to collect suggestions through saturday so i can download everything get it set up and so i'm going to be taking today and saturday to prepare simulcasting to make sure i have everything ready to go for both youtube and twitch streaming that day I'm super excited for that stream. I hope you all are around for that. Um, this will also get posted as a community note on the YouTube page. And I hope to see you all there. So thank you all for bearing with me. Thank you all for sticking around. Thank you all for viewing the content. And if you stuck around through this video to this point, could you subscribe and like? Because I'd love you for that. That's all I've got for you today. Stay tuned for Flashback Friday tomorrow. And I will catch you on the flip side. Toodaloo!